If I can't keep my head held high enough, I'll just be love and watch the smiles come. Bring my spirits up. There's some shit I like to fix, but I still know that I'm blessed. It's really dark, but the river's just on the other side of that. We'll see it tomorrow. Someone else got our spot, so they found us somewhere for us to go in and just making the best of it. I'm sure this is like black. Can't probably see a thing. They got cute little cabins. That's the bathroom. We've got the gate, the bathroom code. Hopefully, we still have room to put our other stuff up here. It looks like tomorrow when the rest of the gang comes. She's sleeping. We got a Goliath on each side of us. We'll show you the David and Goliath tomorrow. We had dinner. We need to recharge some of the batteries for the string lights and stuff. But yeah, we made it. It was pretty smooth sailing. We can't wait to like, we think the creek's that way and the river's the other way. We'll, we'll check it all out tomorrow. If there's one of the Goliaths, so you can't really see it. All right. Say goodnight. Say goodnight. Night-night. <laughs> Love you, girl. Listen to the frogs. There's the moon through the trees right there. And there's so many stars. But you guys can't see them because that's the moon through the trees. Good morning, rise and shine, it's daylight. Oh. Look over here. I guess you can't go in there. We can't go in here? Why can't we go into this beautiful oasis? <laughs> Look at the grass and the beautiful rocks over there. Look at the cobwebs, it hasn't, it's not traveled often. Wow, how beautiful the water. All right, I'll follow you for the big reveal. Ouch, thanks guys. <laughs> Spun that into my shins. Oh yeah, you could. Yeah, the life preserver. Yeah, that water doesn't look like it's moving fast, but that's fast. He's ready to be fishing after we set up and stuff. She's going to the bathroom. Don't yank her. Wow, look at this, it's beautiful. Is this, this is the resort stuff here, right? Yeah. You can tell because it's all cobwebby and and that they have stuff for you to tie your boats off or whatever, probably here. Awesome. So she wanted us last night to basically squeeze in right here, but we didn't want to be that close to everybody. So we picked a different spot, but this is beautiful, isn't it? And I guess the picnic benches are just down here. We don't have a picnic bench, but that's all right. Wonder if we'll see anybody boating down here. Yes, I wouldn't, I mean, it wouldn't be bad to stand right there, I don't think, huh? Yeah. 
The water is so clear and nice. Good morning, little doggy. Did you have a good night? She wants to go swimming. Mm. It's gonna be a hot one, but it'll cool down tonight. And we've got shade and other stuff, so. Very small campground, but very nice and very quiet. <laughs> go down this way. Be fun to go on a kayak, but then what? You get to the other down there, and then how do you get back? It's not like you turn around and go back the other way. Oh, she's giving a little extra. So the campground. That's pretty much it. That's the end of it where the dumpster is down there. It's just these few little sites and cabin cottages and in the host. And then they were going to have a squeeze right here and stay. And we're next to giant Goliaths again. Bye for now. So it's time to set up camp. When we get to camp late, we don't set it up because that's rude. You know, people are winding down for the night. I want to look at the creek. Oh, the creek has got hardly any water. <laughs> okay, how cute. But we're on the creek. It's a fallen tree. So anywho, I don't want to get my license plate. We're going to set up the bathroom here. And the tent probably there. We're trying to figure it all out. Bed is made. We did lose temporarily, hopefully, the other dowel for the other side. We've searched everywhere in this tiny space. Cannot find it. So when we're looking for something else, we will find it. The dog's restless. We've been giving her um, stay. Some new, like, melatonin hemp calming stuff. And we've tried it yesterday and today and we're thinking one might not be enough so we're going to see if two of the little chews helps her a little because we've got grandbabies coming and stuff and we don't want her psycho party animals here party animal got up first this morning so we're gonna get camp set up i wish i could put a little tripod and like film us one of these days film us like putting everything up and then like fast forward it or whatever you know Right, bye for now. Okay, I'm trying to help him set up the bathroom, but you guys got to see all these groups are um, rafting wars. down the river and having, uh, what do they call those blaster, water blaster wars? <laughs> There's been so many boats going by, it's awesome. Uh-oh, into the bushes. Can you hold this? Oh, it's stable, cool. We're just meeting our neighbor. We have a lot in common. Whoa. I'm gonna tape a little of these. Yeah, big groups, how fun, huh? And they have everything set up here for people to chill on the hammocks and the chairs. We'll go down there in a bit. Here comes some more rafters. I gotta help Bobby set up though. I got chat and chit chat and they have a big community bonfire thing here. Really cool tents and these little cabin things are just so cool. Coming. All right, the tent is up. The side room is up. The other umbrella is up. Sorry, I'm close quarters here. The site's not that huge. I'll show you a little bit. A little bit of, she's chilling in there with her little uh, chew toy with snacks, sneaker, whatever they call it. I'll be right there. I just oh, yeah. wanted to show this real quick. Here's the kitchen area. This is where we're gonna be seating. We had to put this because people were using this as a path to get to the water. Already met these neighbors, very nice. Had nice chats, met the kids. Kitchen, side. All right, now we're gonna go to the water. Coming. We're not gonna be down there long, right? You said as soon as you put your toes in, you're gonna be too cold. It's a long hike to the river, as you can see. I don't know what river it is. Did you look at the creek water, how there's like hardly any? No. There's like a trickle in there. Yeah, it's good. Our setup. It's almost like they don't they don't want to make it so you go down to the water. 
I guess hey, what's we... happening, man? What's happening? I think we'll go in right there, maybe. It's so pretty. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right? That was fine for a minute. And then quick solution There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Rapid solution, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think I'm gonna put my feetsies in. I'm not gonna take the camera because I don't trust myself. Knowing Bobby, he'll do a dive from the side or back foot. Just kidding. Are you going in? At least your feetsies. It's supposed to be frigid. Oh, those cool tents that have this porch, enclosed porch. I like that. Let's see. He's pretty tough, so whatever he thinks it is. There he goes. It's not that cold, I guess. You didn't react like shocking. That's too bad. It's cold. Oh, he's gonna put it on his face? Oh, is this gonna be another one of those boom chicka boom booms like the other episode? Wait till you see what You're gonna. I'm gonna do. <laughs> I'll give you guys an inside scoop on that. There's a lot of YouTubers that will exploit their wives in the thumbnails where like their booty sticking out. Ooh, he went all the way in. You can jump from there. All right. So anyway, the thumbnails, and then you'll watch the video, and there won't be two anything. Not one piece of <laughs> or anything. <laughs> and they're always exploiting the ladies, so Bobby doesn't mind. I'm going to start exploiting him. You are in the thumbnail on that one, too. <laughs> oh, it's so fun. Oh, here they come. Look at you can see the super soakers and everything. They're like chanting. <laughs> see him shooting the super soakers all the way up. You guys can stay up here? All right, I'll be back in a moment when they get closer. I went in there. It felt so good. Just my feet. All right. Here they come. <laughs> See how swift that water goes? I wonder where they're getting out. So the point is. Beep. Oops, yeah. But refreshing, right? You feel like a new man now. I just don't want to get on my shorts. Man. You don't want to get them wet? I wonder how far they've come already when they get to this point. <laughs> Fun. We used to do this with my dad's family, as you know. But it was white rapids we went on. It was, you already know, we almost had a fatality on one of them. <laughs> There they go, they're jamming. Woo! <laughs> uh oh, they're getting sideways right there. That looks like a good time. All day long. Nice and cool. Teamwork. We got some people going up against the current here in a little kayak. It's very nice down here. The shade makes it nice and it's not too hot in the shade. What are those that everybody has? Is that a solar panel? Yeah. Now my panels are, would be an overkill. Oh, did you hear that? The photographer is right there for them. She said something, something. Your photographer's on the left, so you know that they, they sell the pictures when you uh, huh? They probably thought I was it. They're all getting all woo posing and like doing their thing. It's like, no, I'm not, I'm not the photographer. Well, I am, but yep, there's more coming from down there. Where did I ditch my shoes at? All right, so we do need to eat though, because we'll be hangry. 
but it should be pretty simple. So there was a big mix us we told you about. They, this was supposed to be our spot, but they gave it away to someone else, which was fine. It's, it's all good. We don't let things like that get to us. Take out the vehicle. So this is uh, approaching our site right by the cute little bridge that I wish we could go over. And we're about to make uh, breakfast burritos, vegetarian breakfast burritos with vegan meat, but real eggs. Chef Bobby. She's chilling. The grandbabies will be here in a couple hours. We have two waters and two electrics. <laughs> But no one's plugged into oh, that, yeah. is what I'm making a joke. So here's the preparations for the food. He's got the tortillas, the vegan cheese, green onion in here, eggs, vegan sausage, salsa to put on it. We like to just do the easy canned potatoes, just for simplicity and uh, speediness. So I'm gonna leave this to him and I'm gonna go get dressed. Is that cool, babe? Yeah. Bobby spotted some berries down here in the little creek. There's actually berries on there, see them? Yum. Oh, here comes some more rafters. Catch them in this little spot as we go by. All day, every day. We get ready, because uh, breakfast is gonna be ready. I don't want to do that though, actually. I've done that canoeing, kayaking, rafting, all that as a kid, I'm good. But it's fun, my younger years. All right, I'm gonna go get ready. So I'm ready for my breakfast burrito, I'm excited. Real easy thing to do camping, I'm so good. I'm gonna put this up for you. In case you haven't seen it, this is the little side room with the roof and the walls and privacy area, especially from we don't have the big tent up. There's the mirror, the wipes, and then I just keep all my, basically my bathroom in the back here. So I'm gonna brush my teeth and all that good stuff. Oh yeah, I gotta get the journal out. I gotta do journaling later tonight. I do a little bit of journaling on this trip. Okay, right, bye. All right, I'm all ready. Got my little tight ice skirt on. Still cooking breakfast. All the rafters keep going by. I'm gonna show you the place and uh, <coughs> the restroom. So they have these cute little cabins. I could see inside and it was like a bedroom and then a little bathroom in the back. Super cute. And I think they had, I think the campsites, the highest number is 16. Doesn't seem like there's 16 sites in here, but. That's what the numbers go to. Cute little cabins. The camp post is there uh, closest to the river. Oh, maybe, because it does start. It does start a little bit on the other side of that. Okay. That makes sense. Lots of families here. It's been quiet. There's no partiers. Um, so, so far, so good. I know, Polly. It's cool. Hi. Hi. No, that's cool. Yeah, Tulip Lake, we've been there. So that used to be the office, but now you just go to our host thing. These are the bathrooms. You have a little code, so. I'm gonna point to the ground and make sure it's in here. They're actually nice. This area is where the toilet part is. Then you've got the sink area here, and there's, there's a mirror there, and there's a full length mirror here. And then a really nice big shower, and the shower is actually free. I'm gonna shower tomorrow or tonight, probably. So yeah, cute little place. We need to uh, come back this way in August. So we're seeing if we're gonna have this be where we camp. And it's super hot here, but the shade really makes a difference. And of course, you got the uh, river right there to jump in and cool off. So yeah, a little different angle of these cottages. I don't know how much they cost. They're super cute though. We would have known we would have had his uh, daughter and family, which includes three grandchildren, stay there. Oh, they have picnic tables too. We don't have a picnic table. Oh, look, they have their whole little setup for the kids. 
Yeah, that's the neighbor we talked to. Wow, they really set it up nice. Awesome. All right, there goes another raft down the river. Everyone's having fun. Oh yeah, breakfast burrito time. We made another table. So now we know another table with our tubs, honey. Mm -hmm. Can I be on this side? You be on that side? Like right there, in front of you? This is in front of me. All right, not a bad little breakfast spot. And you brought a candle over yet, Citronella. So this is the little mini air conditioner. They show you guys the cute little teardrop keychain and it goes with Bobby's son's thumbprint and one of our favorite sayings regarding him, which is a story for another day, but we keep that in here with Green Bear. She's down here right now. He's getting ready for the grandkids. They're gonna be here soon. Shades to the top. Put this little cardboard piece for now that it just slides on that. Alright, check it out. I got the block up there. We got the blackout on the windows. And here's a little AC fan thing going. Did I bring my water in here? I don't think I did, darn it. It's so hot I need my water. <laughs> I think it's right outside my door here. This is my new little thing to try to boost, put under me to get in so I don't use my knees so much. This little gap here. It's kind of like getting in and out of a bucket. See how this mattress goes down from the door. When I asked Bobby if we could lift the mattress higher, then he says you move, you lose the head room. So, you know, when you're in a space this small, one thing affects the other. But um, this seems to be good. So I like, put it right here and it kind of fills that gap. And then, and I'm coming in backwards on my bottom and getting out that way instead of coming in on my knee. Because it was hard on my knees coming in and putting like my full body weight on my old knees. There's my water right there. We've had the, a problem with people just stopping through the campsite and upsetting the dog. It's really getting old. I finally had to talk to a couple people about it. And, I've heard other people talk about the campground etiquette, like don't go stop up through people's campsites. So anywho, I'll be in touch in a while when everyone gets here. I think I'm gonna chill and give them some greeting time and stuff because the kids will probably be pretty wound up and I'm not gonna film the kids, but um, maybe some scenes where you'll hear them in the background or whatever, I don't know. Bye for now. Okay, now I'm laying down and chilling. Benefit number one. I have it like pointed right at me. I want to chill. And Bobby's back in the galley. You can hear him back there. It's like kind of shaking. <laughs> the dog's over in the side room here. Oh, oh, she hit her shoulder on that. Be careful. Hi. He's gonna go to the. Oh my God, her tail hits everything in here. <laughs> She wants to know what that is. Grandpa's gonna go to the river without us. I don't wanna go right now. I wanna just relax. It's been stressful today with the people bothering her. You can lay on that. There you go. There you go, baby. You don't have to get all the way under there when I'm in here. When it's not everybody. When it's everybody, you gotta get under. You look hot again. All right, so I take this yoga thing, put it here, and then I just go out this way, basically. And I want to go uh, spray off. It's hot. The dog just got sprayed off to cool her off, and now it's my turn. All right, exiting the teardrop because it's hot. I wish I was brave like Bobby and I could just go jump in the water. But I will at least spray down with the... 
when they got, we had to do this so they'd stop trampling through the camp, literally. <laughs> this is crazy. Good girl, stay. We'll be right back. Let me lay on your bed. Oh, the shade's over here. Bobby's gonna just throw one. I'm gonna chill on the water's edge. His daughter's only half hour late. She'll be here soon. <laughs> I'm really tired. The heat wears me out. Oh, wow, look at that. <laughs> I'll show you guys from down here. They have like a whole water slide. Oh, and these guys are doing like a little island. Staying at the edge. Look at that, how cool. Looks like it's maybe it's somebody's birthday or something. Where'd you, how'd you go in? <laughs> well, I come somewhere. I come somewhere people on the rafts. I wish there was a way to like put your feet in. Oh, he's on a single. First one I've, oh, they're different. Okay, they're doing, huh. So that's like their own stuff, not a, like, um. <laughs> Weirdo. <laughs> that's fun. Oh, so okay, you got doubles. So they have ice chest things in the middle. They got their music, pillows. Wow, that looks, that looks comfortable. And then this guy's, he's the single dude. <laughs> so yeah, fun. All different ways to enjoy the river. And these kids, man, they have their own water park right <laughs> here. That's so cool. They were having a lot of fun. I was wondering what was going on. Did you see those ones? They have ice chest on them and like pillows and you're like kicked back. Those are like party, party rafts. <laughs> so this dog got left at the bar last night and so the camp hosts are keeping keeping the dog safe until they find the owner it's posted on facebook and then over here we have a dog on board he's got his life jacket on whoa he almost slipped i don't know if he likes it or not he's leading the way though <laughs> He's very much keeping an eye on things. Oh, they all. So we got three paddle boarders coming now. That looks oh, one standing. Yeah. And uh, the folks were chatting with, I guess, three hours further down is where you get out of the water. So it's a long haul, it sounds like. And as of yesterday, the water was at least 18 inches higher than what you're seeing now and more rapid. They control the flow at the dam, so. And he's checking on the dog. I think she's doing good, good. It has flavor throughout. <laughs> he's gonna try these weird ranch fries, oven baked crunch. Let's see what, what he thinks here. Like Funyuns. Oh, like a Funyun, okay. Corn and potato snack, it's vegan. What do they call them? Andy. Oh, and Andy Caps. Andy Caps. Oven baked crunch. Okay, I'll try one because you didn't make a weird face. Let's see. Have a funion. That's what they look like. Have a funion stick. Oh, it's like broken funion. <laughs> they also have hot fries, cheddar fries, barbecue fries. Those are good. Yeah, we have a cheese one or something in here too. Oh, cheese. Snacks to share. Those are good. They're savory. They're savory throughout. <laughs> Put in the comments if you know what we're talking about. We actually like these YouTubers. They're cute and funny, but we chuckle a lot at some of the things they say and do. And you can chuckle at us too. Yeah, I like the seasoning. You guys are nice. What's up? <laughs> the grandkids will be here soon. He's being summoned by strangers <laughs> to uh, 
get the Black Widow out of the tent? He's like, sure. Yeah. <laughs> I guarantee there ain't just one. <laughs> oh, gosh. Is it a widow bed? Yeah. Oh, golly. I'm glad you guys found it now. I got paper towels. Where's it at? I'll put them on. Oh. Uh, I don't think it's safe to sleep in there. What do you guys think? I don't know. Do you have like a bug candle or anything? Maybe you could burn it in there for a while during the day? That's scary. Your tent doesn't look like it's... Oh, yeah. There are some webs and stuff, girl. I don't know. He okay, so he's good and smashed. Thank you just you keep so using much. the bag. Are you it okay? was a black widow, yeah. There's black widows don't congregate. perfect because I don't like to put the kids faces on the channels none of my nieces or your kids like so this is just the back of them and then I have to put emoji heads on my nieces and stuff. <laughs> their mom always says it doesn't matter I'm like no I don't Opening, opening presents, about to set up the pool. We got kayakers coming now. Some of those uh, rafts, they have like thump, boop, 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 like thumping music. And, and the soap, yeah, and the, so the soapers, quarters are all like, They never go back in the box we anyway after you use it. Yeah. Oh, wait. It'd be a real good memory. Yeah. It's the river water. How about we water. do it This is what grandpas do for their granddaughters. So the kids are gonna splash around in this in a little bit. Very exciting on a hot day. Nice little pool.
been a long day of playing in the sun with the grandbabies. We just said goodbye. The dog is back amongst us. Bobby's got his lion mane, lion's mane mushroom chopped up again that he grows his own, at his own farm. Chopped up, diced up some onion. This will be having a classic marinara and plum tomato, yum. That's the sauce his daughter picked for us. That sounds like a good one. We moved the setup to over here, so he's got a light in his outdoor kitchen extension. <laughs> he's gonna use grapeseed oil. Got his seasonings. Oh yeah, my friend's company owns this uh, slow mix. Slow is in the San Luis Obispo mix. And we're gonna have vegan meatballs with cheese spinach ravioli. Looks good. Texas toast, green onion thrown in there too. And then we're just having some black olives for appetizer right now. So yeah, oops, mess. So that's gonna be a camping dinner. And it's late, <laughs> we played until the wee hours with the kids. I don't know what time it is, but I know it's late. Everybody else is chilling already. Oh, I wanted to tell you guys too, last night Bobby checked his phone. He checked on the fridge, sorry I'm eating olives. And it, the temperature was rising. He's like, what? It had come unplugged, but luckily his phone told him so he was able to go fix the situation. Uh-oh. Can't help out. All right. Dinner time soon. All right. There's the vegan meatballs and the delicious finished ravioli. Cooking away. And then we got his uh, world famous mm -hmm. lion's mane mushroom, which basically tastes like chicken. <laughs> you never heard that before. And then here's the sauce his daughter got us that'll go on. Yeah, I need to get our plates. We like to eat on these. They're very big. And, and let me get our forks out of here. Got a lot of stuff out here right now. Iced tea. Okay, the forks are in here. Don't worry, we don't have so much stuff in the way. Wow, that fork. Huge. A certain fork. Two different forks. It's been a long day, especially for the DOG. She's done so good. I'm so proud of her. Alright. We just added the sauce for you. Ta-da! Ravs, Texas toast, meatball, vegan meatballs, lion's mane. There's the manly, the hungry man set. Time to eat. Hey girl, you need grandpa help you? Yeah? It's like the talking dog. I think this is how they do it in the movies. She's got a treat that got stuck on her cheek. Bobby has to help her get it out. <laughs> but that's how they make them look like they're talking, I think. Where is it, girl? Did you get it? Did I get it? If not, Grandpa's got to stick his fingers in your mouth. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you were Grandpa. She was ready to bounce on whoever that was. Well, it's approaching midnight. Uh-oh. Sorry, I got the snack out. She's chilling. Mm. Bobby's in the side room. Having some chocolate. I just got all this organized, washed my face, washed my feet. Look at this cool, uh, this is from Bobby's friend. It's like this cool collector pen. And one thing we realized we did, we didn't know <laughs> till one of the nights we were camping, watch. Oh, hold on, I didn't, I guess it's not energized enough. It glows in the dark. It was kind of in the wrinkle there, so. Wow, there's some really loud music. Oh, is that another movie? People are watching outdoor movies and stuff. I guess it's faint because the orange light's under, but it's glowing. It's that time again, journaling in Bobby's Italian leather journal. <laughs> so 
So I always do at least one page at each place we go. Rescue boat coming back through. Here they come. Rescue boat had to go find someone or help somebody out. So Bobby just gave me a good update. The water rescue today, the emergency on the river, um, the raft failed, which I'm assuming means it lost its air. And the helicopter was actually what rescued them. I don't know how many people, but they're all safe. And it's good. Did it say how many? Hmm? Juveniles. Oh, some youngsters. So we prayed for them and we're so glad that God protected them and they're all all right. So that's what the boat racing by was. Everyone came out of it all right. Good job, first responders. If I can't keep my head held high enough, I'll just be love and watch the smiles come. Thanks for watching. Bring my spirits up. Don't forget to stop and smell the flowers. There's some shit I